It's July 30th, 2010, and I'm here with Isaac Hines and Ron Avedan, a.k.a. the experts. And even though the big shoe this weekend is the USA Championships, the record 525 competitors, we're going to give you the in-sky-side -sky, in scoop <laughs> on the Olympia. I'm sorry, I'm Yogi, I've been hanging. The heat's getting to you, Lonnie. Oh, my God. I've been hanging around Yogi too much. <laughs> anyway, I want to tell the fans here, listen, you got to cut us a break. This is eight weeks out, and we still have pro shows to go, so things may change a little bit. But, you know, we have to give the other uh, prognosticators a handicap because we dominate the scene when it comes to predictions. So we're going to do it eight weeks out, and uh, we'll see how close we come. Now, as everybody knows, last year, the guy you're looking at picked Jay Cutler to regain the sand out. First They're person. at all of us. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, you got a point there. there. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't that's it. right. Okay, the guy with the least amount of hair. <laughs> That'd be you. But had, <laughs> that's me. Pick Jay Cutler to regain the sand out. He did. And I'll tell you right now, I'm going with Jay Cutler to win his fourth Ooh. Mr. Olympia title in eight weeks. Swami, that's he. Isaac Hines that's of the famous hardbody.com, the greatest female site of all time. That's, that's very kind of you. You tell me who your Mr. Olympia is. Then we're going to give you our top ten in order. Oh, man, you know, I got, I got some torn feelings here. Not, not torn muscles because that would require me to work out. But... I'm going to have to stick with the Denver Nugget, Phil Heath. Now, Phil, don't be getting food poisoning. Don't be coming with some whatever it was, bad cod. Or... you got to deliver this time because Kai Green is going to overtake your pick. Well, uh, Phil Heath did look terrific at last year's Arnold, the... losing a close decision yes. to Kai Green. I, and I actually would have had him winning, you know, all by side. So but that, that certainly isn't a stretch going with Phil Heath. So Phil Heath is still my pick. I think Phil's going to bring it. And I got Kai Green in second. Yogi. Yes, sir. Who wins it? I like Jay Cutler, but you took him. I like Phil Heath, but you oh, took him. look at this. Back. Let's backpedal. Let's backpedal. I'm going to have to go with Kai Green to take it all. Okay. I got Cutler. I'm going on that one. Okay. Two-time Arnold champ. He's going no, way out. No, I've had Kai Green since uh, day one in July. <laughs> you just said the only reason you took him is because I took Cutler. No. Kai Green, Kai Green is going to win the Olympia this year. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to give our top ten in order. Okay. I'll go first. You have your, I made a list right here. Okay. This is how it's going to be, I think. Now, remember, we may do this again before the Olympia because we have the Europa in two weeks, and that's the debut of Big Cedric McMillan, last year's Nationals champion. I think it can be a terrific pro. I'm going with Jay Cutler first, Kai Green second. I'm sticking Phil Heath in third, the Blade Dexter Jackson in fourth, Branch Warren in fifth, Victor Martinez in sixth. My long shot right now is Cedric McMillan. Big Mac ain't no hamburger, but I haven't seen him on a pro stage, so I may change this. But if he wins the Europia, like I'm predicting, I have him in seventh. I have Raleigh Winkler, the New York champion, in eighth. I got Tony Freeman finishing ninth. Ronnie Raquel rounding out the top ten. Two guys on this cusp. Mark Alvisi is making his pro debut this year. I really like his physique. And Dennis Wolf, two X factors. Hard body, you're on. Yeah, well, let me borrow your notes because I forgot my list. Ron has the digital version. Ron, did he leave anybody off? I don't think so. Because I don't think, who, who we got? Go down the list real fast. Troy Alves, I don't think, has a chance. You Rapid fire. No. Jay Cutler. Why are we doing this? You're supposed to give your top ten. Okay, here we go. Your top ten. Oh, I was refreshing. Okay. So I'll mix these up. I'm going up from your notes. And I, I don't have my glasses, so I got it. I don't have my glasses, but I'll read this. Uh, Cutler will not be in first, but I will predict Phil Heath in first with Kai Green second. So i got to agree with you on that one. Kai Green in second. Uh, I'm going to go with the Blade in third. With, uh, These the picks fridge. are stunning. The fridge in fourth. Dropping, dropping like a ton of bricks. Dropping faster than the ice in his fridge. Jay Cutler going to fourth. What a pick. What a pick. <laughs> Leading candidate for bonehead pick of the year. Well, Surpassing Bob Chicarillo's pick of Darren Charles winning in Tampa, who got 10th, well, but that's we'll another story. See, we'll see, you you're going way out on a limb. That's yeah. Two well, for guys, <laughs> two guys who haven't even competed as pros, you have in the top 10. I've done worse. <laughs> We're aware. Uh, and then I'll go with um, Victor Mar now. Victor Martinez in fifth. Uh, 
Branch Warren sixth. Actually, I, I like Raleigh for that top six. So you got Raleigh, Raleigh in six. Six and Branch seventh. Oh my God, hard body is really yeah, going out there. I love these type of picks. Yeah, bonehead is so well Cutler <laughs> and Branch. Yeah. I like Branch too, but uh, You're sleeping much lately? Did you, I just got. Did you go out late? Actually, you go out last night? night? Did you open no. up to Pearly no. Gates? No, no, <laughs> no. I went to the Hard Rock with okay. uh, Mr. J. Manion. Uh, but, yeah, I did wake up from a nap, and it could be affecting my – where am I at? I think you're going to eight. You're going to eighth now. Hmm. You have Branch Warren in seventh. Yeah, I do. Who was second last year, by the way, fans? Victor. Victor was in fifth. You're asking me where you put him? <laughs> yeah, Victor fifth. <laughs> wow, I sound like Yogi. <laughs> this is my best Yogi impersonation. <laughs> uh, then I'll go – I'll agree with you. I Actually, I'll go uh, Ronnie Rocco in ninth. Tony Freeman, not 10th, but out of the top 10 with the X-Man. Oh, another yeah. out there pick. And I will put Mark LVC in 10th. I, I like that pick. I like LVC. He hasn't even competed yet, mind you. I think he's going to be second or third at the Europa. I think he'll be first or second at the Europa. I don't know. I don't know. Let's Here's Yogi's top 10 in order. Why is everybody looking at my notes? I okay. made notes. <laughs> I got Kai Green first. Yeah, Phil Heath second. Branch Warren third. Jay Cutler fourth. Whoa! Both of you got Jay in fourth, and I got him in first. Martinez fifth. Dexter Jackson sixth. Oh, the blade in sixth. He's rusty. Yes, yes. No way. Um, I got Rolly um, in seventh. <laughs> Roll, rolling. Hey, you guys, Tony Freeman, eighth? You guys don't, I have Dennis Wolf in ninth. Oh, and him. Cedric, I think, will take the top ten. He's going to make it. I know he's going to make it. So he's, you have said Big Mac in tenth. Big Mac in tenth. So yeah, you're I leaving. About, I forget about Wolf. Who'd right? you leave out of the top ten? I didn't put LVC in there. That's not well, a bad pick. I mean, did I put Tony Freeman? Oh, he's going to kill me Yeah, again. you put him in like <laughs> okay. eight. Okay, good. You got Thank to God. Yes, I won't but get now, my chocolate chip cookies. Dennis Wolf should be in the top ten, but who knows? I mean, he needs to dramatically improve. I'll tell you this. The, the hype that's been built. I'm disappointed about him. I mean, he was terrible at last year's Olympia and had the excuse about the trainer, so he came back yeah. to New York Pro, well, and, and he gets 30. And, trainer. Yeah, and another. And something that with a new tr new trainer and so, carbing uh, and all that. To me, he's got to prove it now. He's, I've lost the confidence in Wolf to put him in the top ten. And you, I actually have to give you credit. You did say two or three years ago when he was fourth, you didn't think he should have finished that high, and you saw holes in his physique. Yeah, I mean, he'll make the top ten this year. Well, I, know, I mean, I could see him being in the top ten, but I'm still like his back from the back. He's not crazy. Like he's got the really long torso and high lats, and it's he hasn't nailed that conditioning. So, and you know, he hasn't been like any wow factor for me. So the bottom line here: there is no clear cut winner this year. Yes, there is. Yeah, Jay Cutler. No, 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 no. I agree. <laughs> that is clear cut. Wait a minute. So, as the fans can see. LT has Cutler number one winning again. Both Hard Body and Ron GetBig.com has Jay falling all the way to fourth. You have what Branch Warren falling, yeah. who was second last year, falling to. I need seven. to rethink that. Oh my God. And I don't even remember what your picks were. I think I had Branch in third, right? Yes, you had Branch in third. So that's it for Isaac Hines. And Ron, Big Daddy Abaddon, this is Lonnie Teeper signing off for IronManMagazine.com. Over, under, out.